In a land filled with delicious nut ice creams, we must decipher which is the best. Is it almond? Is it coconut? Or is it cashew? We join Chelsea Lifts, Sammy Grimm, and Hercules now to find out. What is going on, friends and family of the channel? With me on my right, I have Sammy Grimm, my beautiful Hi. girlfriend, and I have <laughs> the illustrious Chelsea Lifts. So I want to do this, this taste test so that we can tell you um, what our favorite base is for the ice cream, whether it's coconut, almond, or cashew. And also, we're going to be comparing the flavors here because we have coconut bliss, we have cherry amaretto, which is kind of an interesting flavor, never had that before. The So Delicious, this one is cashew milk, and this is salted caramel cluster. Then we have Almond Dream, which is cappuccino swirl, which is my favorite type of uh, ice creams, which is coffee. Mm -hmm. Okay, which one should we go into first? Let's do the cherry, because I feel like I'm not gonna like that one. So this is coconut milk. Yes, this is made out of coconut. Just right off the bat, it looks icier. Yeah, it does. Then, uh than the other ones. Yeah, it looks watery. Yeah, you see me putting the cherry in the other one? Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, ready? Three, two, Juan. Okay, it's not that mm. bad. Mm -hmm. It smells like cough syrup, but it's actually pretty good. That's really good. It's a nice mild cherry. Yeah, yeah. it tastes like a mild cherry. It is very icy though. Yeah, it is. Like it's not a super creamy ice cream. Right. right. I don't know if that's the ca uh, the case with all coconut milk ice creams. I haven't really had any, but this specific one is. Mm. Yeah, I've had coconut ice creams before and they always tend to be more watery than mm -hmm. other types. Definitely, Definitely. not as, as um, creamy. And this is interesting aftertaste too. Like I don't know if all coconut ice creams do this, but this one specifically goes cherry, and then once you like finish swallowing and breathe out, then you get coconut mm -hmm, blasted. Mm -hmm. Yep, definitely. Which I like, because I like coconut, but you might not like if you don't like coconut. I give the flavor a, I give the flavor a 7.5 out of 10. That's pretty good. And the texture, I give a seven out of 10. Mm-hmm, yep. I would give it mm, probably an eight out of 10 for flavor and like seven out of 10 for texture. Mm. Okay, okay. I'm gonna give it a six out of 10 for flavor. <laughs> And, the and then the texture, I'll give a, a six as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit more. No, no, no. It's all right. It's the, if, if you don't like cherry, it's kind of blah, blah, blah. But Screw okay. your six out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> Not that many people, I'm sure, look at macros <laughs> for these types of things, but mm. I'm surprised at how high fat it is for how icy it is. Like you would think the fat would make it creamier. That's a good point. That is a good point. Okay, let's go with the So Delicious Cashew Milk next. Yes! Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Mmm. That's so delicious. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> Flavor, 10 out of 10, mm -hmm. period. So good. I've had a lot of the So Delicious brand and all of them are amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one's definitely up there. It's so creamy. The nice thing about this is it has like little bits of chocolate in it too, so you get a nice other texture other than just plain <laughs> ice cream. It's so delicious. Texture, 9.5 out of 10. Yep. Like that's mm -hmm. amazing, that's up there. Definitely blows this one out of the water for me. For sure. This one was twice the, the price too. Which is well, really? Damn. Yeah. Wow. I think it's because it's organic. Mmm. 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 Mm. The caramel on this is so good. I know. It's, mm. it's unbelievable. <laughs> Last one is the Almond Dream Cappuccino Swirl. You don't like coffee, right? No. So we'll see how Chelsea I likes it. I love coffee, so I have high hopes for this. So far though, the other like mocha things I've liked. Three, two, one. Mmm. I need to take a second bite to, to see what I feel. It's not a very strong coffee flavor. Right. Yeah, I was gonna say. At first I was kind of impressed and then I just kind of realized that the flavor is not as intense as I was hoping. Better than I expected because yeah. I don't like coffee. Mm -hmm. It's it's a very, very, um, very mild flavor. Texture is decent. This one's like in between the cashew milk and the coconut milk uh, base, I would say. Definitely. Agreed. Agreed. Yeah, I'm not really impressed with the flavor. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna surprised. try this again so I can realize what real flavor is like. <laughs> yeah, like this one just screams at you the flavor that it is. Mm -hmm. And then this one kind of like whispers at you. <laughs> <laughs> and one thing too, 
Uh, as far as like the flavor from the bases go, I would say you can really only taste the base like mm -hmm. in the coconut milk one. Like oh, you get the point. aftertaste. With the, the cashew and the almond, I don't really feel like I taste cashew or almond, but the coconut definitely is strong enough that it comes through and I think it would no matter what the uh, flavor is. Mm -hmm. I think that's I good note for sure. Yeah. Yeah, like sure. if you don't like <laughs> almonds or cashews, mm -hmm. you aren't gonna have to worry about that mm -hmm. when you yeah. have these. Yeah. If you don't like coconut, you will not like this no. at all. So the flavor on that, I'm kind of disappointed, especially since I like coffee ice cream. Yeah. I, I'm, uh, I'm gonna say like less than the coconut even. I'm gonna say seven yeah. out of 10. Um, texture, I would give an eight or an 8.5 out of 10. Mm -hmm. yeah. I would say, yeah, an eight for the texture. I would say like a six and a half for the taste. Like it's good, but Mm, I don't know. It could be better. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't buy it. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I would say six and a half to seven for taste for mm -hmm. me and like eight and a half for, for texture. It's pretty creamy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like it's a it's it's in between the coconut and the cashew, but like more towards the cashew and then cashews freaking king. Yeah. So yep. <laughs> I think that's that's basically what this video is gonna come down to is if you're looking in terms of texture and creaminess, coconut is at the bottom, then almond is second and then very, very best for any type of uh, non-dairy ice cream is gonna be cashew. cashew. It is so, so creamy. And all of the cashew ice creams that I've had, not even from So Del Delicious, like any brand, are all extremely creamy. Mm -hmm. So that that's the one I would go for. And then in terms of flavor for all these companies, I guess I guess So Delicious is getting the king spot here because <laughs> by far. Also by the far. best flavor yeah. is the So Delicious salted caramel one. Yep, um, it's the best one by far. Right? It is. There you go guys, I just wanted to do this taste test real quick because this is a high demand topic for people who like ice cream, you know what I mean? Like you go in there, you're not sure because there's actually now a lot of different choices that are non-dairy when you go into the freezer section. Mm -hmm. So next time you do go in there, try So Delicious, try the cashew milk of any type of mm -hmm. brand and you are going to be impressed. And then depending on what you thought about what we said about the other ones, try those out as well. Yep. Mm -hmm. I love you guys. Thank you for checking out this video. Make sure you check out Chelsea Lift's channel and check out Sammy Grimm's channel. I'll put the <laughs> links in the description below and I'll see you guys in the next Next video. Nope, that's not my tagline. <laughs> <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up. Let me know just thought in the comments below and subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Team Beyond the Week. CT. Lift heavy or die, Myron, motherfucker. Mm. Team Beyond the Week. <laughs>